everyone thanks so much for coming back to my channel this is tina with tina's craft creations i am on today with my first project share of the mix and maggie in may um this is going to be a combination of bloom uh chasing dreams and gather um so i did make some embellishments and, uh, and some memory decks cards using those three collections so nothing too crazy but i just felt like crafting today and um i wanted to uh go ahead and start my series so again this is going to be a series this month in may where i'll be mixing maggie holmes collections together to create various projects um so as i had mentioned in my announcement of this series um, if there's anyone who wants to make any recommendations or anything like that please go ahead and leave comments down below and i will try to um you know try to get to those if i can uh, so i'm going to show you the memory decks cards first so I used um, paper from the collections. Like I said, I'm working with the Maggie Holmes Bloom, Maggie Holmes um, Chasing Dreams, and Maggie Holmes um, Gather collections all mixed together. So the first one, uh, and I did back all of these on 110 pound cardstock. So this is the first one. I used ephemera and, and various embellishments from the collections. So I, I can't remember exactly which ones are from which because they all do sort of look alike. So this is the first one. I used um, this sentiment piece here, some chipboard stickers, um, these really pretty butterfly stickers, a rosette from Lori, some chipboard um, thickers, and um, enamel dots from my stash. So. Um, most likely these items will go off to people in racks. Um, I haven't decided how I'm going to be sharing these. Maybe I'll do a giveaway at the end of the month um, where um, I have a few pr um, prizes of different things that I make throughout the month. So yeah, I have to decide on that. And this is the last one. I love that little paper bow. All right, so those are my memory next cards and I did make a bunch of embellishments. I made some of my favorite embellishments which are the little envelopes. <clears throat> I love little envelopes. They're so, so cute. And then, of course, I used gold thread on some of them, enamel dots from my stash. I just think that they turned out so pretty. And, um, yeah, this is just a, a new thing for me to mix collections. I love the little gingham bow I added to this one. <clears throat> I just layered... <coughs> oh, excuse me. <clears throat> I just layered various elements from each collection to create these cute little embellishments and this is the last one of these okay so that's the envelope embellishments and then i did make a bunch of these little banner embellishments that i'm going to show you i just used a die that i have in my stash i took the largest medium size and the smallest um, although most of them you can't even see the smaller ones because they are layered and covered. This is the first one. Again, I used a bunch of chipboard and um, like cardstock stickers, wood embellishments, um, enamel dots. Um, again, all of these are from the various collections that I'm working with. And this one. These would make cute bag toppers too. I love that little book. This one, I love the ampersand. So again, I did stitch the um, three little banner pieces together. Um, so they are um, nice and um, like stuck to each other. Uh, although they are like a little bit free uh, moving at the end because I only stitched until the end of the small one. Yeah, this one, I love these little puppy hearts. And some of them are some ephemera that I got from um, Digitals, and um, yeah, so super, super cute. And then the last one I have is this one. So this is going to be, like I said, my first project in the um, series. This is, again, Mix Maggie in May, and this is going to go on all throughout the course of the month of May. Um, if anyone does have any suggestions or if you want to see me make anything specific, you know, within reason. Um, I might do some project shares, or excuse me, I might do some craft with me's, but I'm not 100% sure because I always feel so incredibly awkward when I do those, um, just because I feel like I ramble on and on and it just gets a little bit, uh, I don't know, annoying in my head that I sound the way I do when I'm rambling. Um, so I'm not sure if I'm going to do those, but uh, I definitely will do several project shares throughout the course of the month. If anyone has any questions, please let me know. If you've not already, I would greatly appreciate if you would consider subscribing. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye everyone.